Hello! Charles Oliveira has been through the gauntlet, hasn't he? 27 fights in the UFC versus the elites of this world, and now here he is. That's what Michael Chandler was up against. They were a talent both in technical ability and fight IQ, etched ruthlessly with wisdom from the grand stage. That's what was standing before Michael Chandler, but even then, with Michael Chandler's wisdom and combat veteran status, physical ability, he looked like he was winning early on. That's how crazy this world is. It does not care about status. It doesn't care about anything except for the person in the moment. That's what we saw with Charles Oliveira. Michael Chandler, he looked very good early on because of his mentality, his physical ability, and ability to explode into space then connect. In the second round though, he did make one mistake. Because Michael Chandler does explode with a huge emphasis on power, the more you focus power, the more likely you are to give up the fundamentals of defensive responsibility. It's a double-edged sword. Thus in the second round, Michael Chandler exploding in with a jab. The second time, Charles Oliveira wanted to time the jab with a slip overhand. Just look at that. The lead arm is down. The explosion to maximize power. Meanwhile, Charles Oliveira with his hands in proper position guards the doom. Chandler had just slung. Then from there, Charles Oliveira with his weight now on that lead leg. The weight had shifted from his right hand onto his lead leg, loading up the front hand. Still in a balanced position, structured, he slightly drops his lead hand and cranks body weight from his hips into his lead hook. Just look at that. Everything, it's so clean. From there, the trajectory, it almost looks like a shovel hook. Michael Chandler, his eyes, he sees the punch. His reaction, it said it all. He instinctively knew that he was way out of position. His hands down, committing that hard, Oliveira, the weight distribution from his hips into the shovel hook with that perfect rotation, that clean, crisp movement, that jolt of body mechanics. When you have perfect rotation, perfect technique, generating the harnessing that to you, don't need a big motion, do you? It's intriguing, you see fighters like Canelo Alvarez sling doom. You see fighters like Manny Pacquiao, who the efficient economy of motion itself will leave quite a sting. Boom. Or Michael Chandler's hand in our turn. Charles Oliveira's make clean connection. From there, Chandler, he cannot contest the following onslaught amidst the thick cloud of concussion. The fight from there, it just ends. Through the echelon of the grand stage, Etched with wisdom, a man from a favela reaches the top. Thank you, Charles Oliveira, for this lesson. Thank you all for watching, and until next time, peace.